Hi, I'm Charlie Hansen from Resource Management. We're here today to witness a historic event, the commissioning of the first Shinchi dehumidification unit in North America. We're here at Brattleboro, Vermont, which is an anaerobically digested facility, and we're going to dry some cake. Let's go take a look. So this is the model SPD 4800. That means this unit will evaporate 4,800 kilograms of water per 24-hour cycle. This is a nice sized machine. It's approximately 7 feet wide by 7 feet tall by about 21 feet long. That was the front of the machine. I'm going to walk to the back. You can see you have these nice access doors. You're able to get to the belts on the inside. All the motors and gearboxes are readily accessible. You can get into the end of the unit with this large door. And on this side is where you access the filters in these different panels. You can access the heat pumps, filters, bearings, bearings on both ends. So here we are with the control screen for the Shinchi dryer. You can see this has the diagram of the full dryer and this is showing you all the operational aspects of the unit. Up top you have the two uh, cooling fans for the condenser units. You have uh, temperature being monitored in the upper belt zone at these two points and the lower belt zone. That's important and I'll get to that in a second. Then the status of the fans that are inside moving the air through the system, circulating it. And then at the bottom, the, the heat pumps that are operating to create the heat to dry the solids. You also know the status of the slitter box that is shaping the cake, as well as your discharge conveyor over here. You can adjust any of these by some of these other screens that are easily seen at the top of the screen. The sludge comes off process and gets sent to the anaerobic digesters. In the anaerobic digesters, the wet uh, solids are dewatered using Fournier rotary presses. These Fourniers were installed approximately eight years ago and put out a consistent 25% cake. Uh, the thing to note there is when you're interested in drying sludge, uh, the more you can dry it mechanically, i.e. with a press, the less energy it will take to dry and the more product you can move through your unit. This is the inside of an SPD 4800. Look up here, you can see discharge conveyor, which currently is discharging into a bin. This is on a timer and it, it, it turns as the belts um, turn, as the slitter loads the belts. Here we have the end product coming off the discharge conveyor. It's being loaded into a bin. This product greater than 90% solids, which is one way to meet vector attraction reduction, and it has met pasteurization requirements with time temperature that's been logged in the Shinshi 4800. So the dried product can be managed in a number of ways in bulk, but Shinshi also provides a one-ton bag holder. These are super sacks, and while this isn't weight-wise a ton, it is a nice way to manage the product once you've dried it. 